In this video, we're going to review how to quickly name and change names on coordinates on a grid in GeoGebra. So, how do you enter a point? Well, I'm going to use my input down here, and that's the way I like to do it, but you also have a tool option up here to enter in new points. And when you use that tool, you can just click right on a location, and a point will then appear. And notice that as I click on, right, it automatically gives you the next letter in the alphabet so you don't need to name all these points with consecutive letters that'll just happen automatically and then when you reach Z notice it starts over again now with A sub 1 and then B sub 1 and so forth and it keeps track of all these points over here in this window if you don't see the window over here for algebra go to view and make sure you select algebra right here but how else can you enter in points well I like using the input down here to type the points in so let's say I want my first point to be 3, 2. I type in capital A, that's the key, equals, and then brackets or parentheses. And notice if you look here, it gives you the first and second bracket together. And what you do is enter the point location. So I enter in 3, 2, hit enter, and then it, of course, puts the point in. But you don't have to type in A, excuse me. You could just type in the value 3, 2, and it would automatically name it A because GeoGebra will automatically name points and will name them in the order that you give them. So let's say my first point is A and it's 3, 2. I just type in parentheses, 3, 2, enter, and notice it names the point A. If I type in another point, let's say 2, 4, it'll automatically name it B. Now if you want to change the name of a point, of course, you just click the point and start typing in, let's say I want to call this D, just type in D and it'll automatically rename the point. Alright, hope that helped.